So climate change is the urgent issue of our time, and we are at a critical juncture when we can and we must and we will lean in to actually change the trajectory of our collective future. So at Tomasev, we are committed to doing our part, and we set an ambitious target to have our portfolio emissions on an absolute basis by 2030, from a 2010 baseline and to achieve net zero by 2050. So we're taking a systems-wide approach to do this and harnessing three key levers. First, investing. Investing into innovative decarbonization technologies, also scaling proven climate solutions. Second is encouraging the decarbonization of incumbent industries, both by engaging and supporting our portfolio companies, and also making targeted investment in the greater green transition. We're also enabling carbon negative solutions. For example, we have a carbon platform called Gen Zero that is investing into nature as well as tech-based solutions and enabling the carbon market ecosystem. Now across all of these levers, we have to do radical partnerships, and we're doing that, partnering with investors to crowd in capital and bring synergies. Also, we're convening and catalyzing ecosystem collaboration. So climate change is already posing an enormous threat to humanity and a future prosperity, and it actually knows no borders. We are seeing the devastating impacts of extreme weather already around the world. Now the good news is when we actually address this challenge, there's an enormous opportunity in front of us. In fact, it's a multi-trillion dollar growth market opportunity that brings innovation, enables significant growth. It's also about resilience and security, as well as enabling higher quality jobs and more community well-being. But we've got to take urgent, we've got to take bold as well as collaborative action to make climate risk into an opportunity. We need to do it across multiple different levers, certainly scaling the green solutions, but also transitioning incumbent industries because it is about the whole economy transformation and doing it in a just and inclusive way. We also need to make sure we are taking a systems approach and bringing all different sectors together with radical collaboration and partnership. And we need to make sure there is better coordination between government, businesses as well as investors, and each and every one of us have to do our part.